Welcome to RVA Homily of the Day. Let us now listen to Father Anthony Benedict OMI as he reflects on today's Gospel. Dear brothers and sisters in Jesus Christ, Today is the feast day of the two sisters in the Bible, Martha and Mary. We have given two Gospel readings to select from it. One is from the Gospel of St. Luke, chapter 10, verse 38 to 42, and the other is from St. John, chapter 11, verse 19 to 27. What is common between these two readings? Prayer is common in these two readings, especially the prayer of St. Martha. She knew the power of prayer. She learned it as she grew on her journey with her Master. In the Gospel of St. Luke, Jesus visits their home, Mary engaged in listening to prayer from Jesus. At the same time, Martha put forward a specific petition, Lord, tell her to help me. Jesus heard her prayer and responded with a correction. Once Martha realized her misdirection, she learns to trust in the Lord instead of worrying about things. Yes, in prayer you trust and pray to Him. In the Gospel of St. John, Martha's prayer is so deepened and her faith has grown greatly because her brother Lazarus was dead. She approached Jesus and confidently said, Lord, if you had been here, my brother would not have died. But even now, I know that whatever you ask of God, God will give you. She does not ask Jesus to raise her brother, but she places her desire in Jesus, her total surrender to Jesus. My dear brethren, we need to approach Jesus with this faith and prayer to ask for the gift of new life, the gift of being overcome by worldly desire and sinful life. Amen. Thanks for listening today. For more homilies, please visit our website at www.rvasia.org.